is Peter Drury and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Thanks for that Peter and may I say a big hello to everyone. And we're underway. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Well, I'd say the ability of Christian Eriksen makes him the standout player. He plays as a free spirit with license to roam to his liking across the attacking third of the pitch. A craftsman and a very smart free kick taker too. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Evra gets it back. Matuidi tries to get it forward quickly. It'll be a throw in. Looks like a good ball through. Kia. Ericsson. It can only get better, this. We haven't seen a shot yet, and I'm hoping that when we do, it'll spark a whole series of them because it needs livening up. Looks to slip it through. Bentner tries a through ball. And that's caused a worry or two. But when he struck that, he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close. Matuidi Sanya Conte Koscielny Giroud Out to the left it goes Giroud Now it's Giroud And he's whipped it in low Decent strike Kept it fizzing low it was very good technique and, and purity behind the hit, but the accuracy was, was just a little off there, Peter. position to make that interception Giroud now the pass shade too heavy keeper can pick that up goal now would certainly liven things up Hoiberg and it's Bentner Pushes it out wide. Bentner hits it! Togba pumps it forwards. And that'll be the final action of the first half. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. Start of the second half. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone could step up and produce something a little more magical. Matuidi, Evra, Matuidi, Evra, aimed long and direct, 
Jesper Schmeichel gets it upfield. Plays a clever pass. Pogba lays it out to the flank. Sanya. Not long left, and still we await the breakthrough. Giroud passes it through. Conte. Knocks it in gently. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Oh, no shortage of confidence there. Listen, I know I'm supposed to remain impartial, but as he progressed, I was willing him on more and more. I wanted him to stick that away. <laughs> Taye with the short one. Pumps it into the area. That's gone a long way up and away. He's offering an apology for that. He needed to deliver a better ball. Now it's Paye. It's a throw in. Denmark have decided now is the time to make their final change. And that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Defence has got rid of that. And it's Eriks. Belts one. Pogba, Schoener battles to win it back. Do they stick or twist, caution or risk? You know, what will they rue more? I think it'd be a cautious mindset they'd regret more for me, so I'd like to see them try and go and win this. Koscielny, Evra, Paye. Koscielny, Matuidi, Evra, Giroud, Paye looking to get on the end of this, Hoiberg, Kia, Hoiberg, and in time is up, and there goes the whistle. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity. Little cutting edge at either end. And it finishes nil-nil. How would you summarise what we've seen?